I'm going to show you how to export a video in Premiere with the Alpha channel. So we have this animation. Let's run the animation. So it has a few images, a subscribe button, then appears a cursor with an image with several keyframes to make the animation and another subscribe button in grey. So we want to export this in a video with the alpha channel to put this on top of other videos. So let's choose the project, click file, export, media, then format. We have a lot of formats, but they are not compatible with the alpha channel. We have H264 that doesn't have the alpha channel. We used to have the format FLV, but Premiere no longer supports that format. So we have to choose QuickTime. We choose export video and export audio. And in these properties, we choose the quality, the resolution, and some other parameters. But the most important thing is RGBA. The A stands for alpha. It's the alpha channel we want. You can see in the animation and this black area is the alpha channel. Let's export this video. We wait for the export. And you have the new file. That's a MOV file. Let's create another project to put our new video. So let's import our new video and some other file. Let's create a sequence and import our animation. So we have the animation but we still have this black area. This is alpha now. But in video format. Let's put some example video below our animation. And we can see our animation on top of the video. Now it's in a video format. And can run on top of our video. And we can have more videos like this during our video. Like put a subscribe button on the beginning and on the end remember again to subscribe. And we can put this video on top of the other. And move the location on the screen to appear on different parts. So now we have our animation showing in several parts of our frame because it has the alpha channel and we can have as many as I want if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe to the channel to see the future tutorials I will publish